In this Scalar 2 modulation quick tip, I'm going to show you the basics of using Scalar's progression modulation preset for a key change in the middle of a song. Step 1. Find a progression preset or build your own. I will use one of the new common chord progressions, Sentimental Colored 1. Step 2. I'm going to change the key from C major to G minor by using the Force to Scale feature. Step 3. Next, I'm going to lasso these four chords and drag them into the progression editor. Step 4. Now, when I click the modulation tab, or use the shortcut, which is Control and 5, I should automatically be on the progression preset. Step 5. At this point, you will choose the desired destination scale using the circle of fifths. An important note here is that the closer to the selected scale in the circle of fifths from the destination, the more fluid the transition will be. I will choose A minor here. Step 6. Take the first chord from the selected scale and two more from the suggested modulation pathway and add them to the progression editor. Sometimes there will be more than just two and for that just rely on your ears to pick the best ones. Step 7. Make sure the last suggested chord is the last chord in the progression editor. This is what's called the pivot chord and it's what does the heavy lifting when facilitating the key change. Step 8. Now select the first four chords in the destination scale progression. Right click and add the chords to a new pattern. Step 9. Jump into the pad view and preview the progression with the key change. If you're happy with what you hear, simply bring the MIDI into your DAW via drag and drop and continue with your song.